Hi, this is Charlie Burton, Easy Trader, using statistics in trading. So this uh, video today is uh, talking about how you can take statistical data to help you make your trading decisions. So I'm going to give you some ideas on this using our brand new artificial intelligence software. Now, if you're interested in learning a little bit about this, just go to easytrader.com forward slash AI hyphen trader so if I actually bring a pen up it's just like this easytrader.com forward slash a i trader hyphen trader okay and that will get you into it forward slash dot com forward slash a i trader okay so and you can read all about it there um, but yeah what we're gonna do is we're gonna take a, a sample one of my prior um, populated uh, uh, tests that I've run and um, and I'm going to take this um, and just give you some ideas here so we've got a load of markets I've selected got a number of time frames um, so four hour charts down to daily charts um, don't need to give you that information <laughs> then we're gonna click on I've um, there's a, ver a variety of stop loss levels that I can have there's a variety of take profit levels and if I then scroll across cause this is scrunched up a little bit for the recording of this video but it's normally um, it's because I'm, I have to do that to make these recordings um, and then if you go to um, risk I can select a, a different type of risk 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 mode dynamic is an interesting one because what dynamic risk does rather than a, a, a fixed percentage it actually will um, act as a multiplier based on um, some of the other figures so I'll go through that with you in a minute and then I can then um, look at things like expectancy and filter out any low expectancy trades anything below let's say 0.2 I can say I only want signals with at least a 50% win rate and a 50% confidence um, confidence is the number of back tests that it holds um, and then I can click on test and there we go and it's come up with a test here so that's a nice okay okay this is one of my already many way ready-made tests so this isn't about showing you how great it is and what the t returns are and, and such likes but this one obviously does come out quite well but let's actually have a look at some of the information along here so for example we can see what over the last 10 years what the maximum drawdown was so useful information there so the maximum drawdown uh, and that's if you took every single trade that was on here, then 16.94%. Uh, so reasonable, reasonably quite low volatility. Uh, the sharp ratio, anyone who understands sharp ratios, then risk adjust, adjusted return. 3.43 um, is a very, very healthy win rate, 55%, and an expectancy of 0 0.62 with an average risk reward of 1.94. So um, that's really quite... An interesting load of information there so how can you utilize this information well one is that you then when it gives you a load of trades I can't show you too much on here but when it gives you trade information it will you know you'll see all of this information in relation to your potential prospective trade so um, when a trade signal comes through to me then I'll know oh okay what the the risk reward ratio has been in the past on a, a huge amount of data I know what the expectancy is um, over a huge main amount of data in fact this is an expectancy across that entire back type test but when I get given a specific trade which let's say for example is on euro dollar um, it on a eight hour time frame then the expectancy may be different on that and so it will show me all that information and then utilizing that with dynamic risk then dynamic risk will um, adjust the risk per trade based on the uh, the quality of the prior results so if it's had and it take gives me a euro dollar trade with an expectancy of let's say 0.62 and all the other information I may have on that then uh, we can put a multiplier on on the um, on the expectancy so if it has a higher expectancy and I have a multiplier of one then it will risk 0.62 of a percent on my account if I have it set at 1.5 then 1.5 times that takes me closer to 1% but if the expectancy on a given trade is 0.27 um, then 
it's going to be risking a lower amount on that. And that's how you can take statistical data and then produce low, lower volatility returns utilizing information like this. Now, all I then need to do is once I've run a test like I've got here, I can then with this software, I can then uh, plug this into um, my um, social media platform into um, Telegram app and so it will send me messages as and when it gets trades coming through. So that's pretty cool. So you run all your tests, then as the trades come through, um, it, I receive messages and then you can click on the message, it will bring up a chart and then saying right do you want to take this trade yes or no and um, and then you can check the chart and make that trading decision so you still have the final say in whether you want to take the trade or not but it's a very very cool um, piece of software so in fact I, I I've been saying to Sam this is a game changer it really is because what it's actually doing is taking all the legwork out of what you would normally be doing as a manual trader so as a manual trader you normally do your back testing yourself you scan the market sit down looking for trade setups uh, whereas something like this is doing all of that heavy lifting for you and then saying here's a trade um, do you want to take this one and then you can then look at all of that data to then say yeah I do want to take this one or no I've actually got a number of trades in at the moment I don't need this one so do check out I'll put a link below in the body in the text below this um, this video today I'll put a link below uh, to so you can go and check out the uh, what's behind this because what's behind this is my DST swing trading strategy that's what is powering the um, um, that's the strategy behind the system so the system takes my strategy which I've been trading for years and then crunches all the data basically and then and then comes up with the algorithms come up with a load of um, and I can change parameters so that they can suit me and it comes up with a load of data on that so if something like that is of interest to you then by all means check that out check that link out uh, because um, it really is something pretty pretty good whereby you can take that information and then actually have it fired directly into your trading account as well so you say yes and then it will then put put the trade into your account with the risk appropriate risk etc etc so it's straight through really but you still get to have involvement in it so it's not black box um, you then still can you know manage your trade so to speak once your trades are on there might be a point where you might want to move your stop up or whatever but it's giving you that core um, data and trade ideas so then you can then um, check out the charts you can use it as a learning tool as well because it's going to show you the charts and all of that as well so there you go but this is how to utilize this sort of information and data it's just one example just utilizing the expectancy ratio to say right okay um, I can utilize that and I can um, adjust my risk based on the expectancy and so um, very very cool way of utilizing data